Outsiders, welcome back. Tony from the Outsider channel here with you once again today. And today we are still in Santa Cruz. Why? Because we're checking off all the trails in Demo Forest. Woo! Last week we did Flow Trail. Check out that video if you missed it. This is a long one, you guys. I was out there for on Strava moving time about three hours. Total time out there over five with almost 4,000 feet of climbing to get saw pit and braille. This ride was so long, we're doing a two-parter. So stick around for next week for braille. Some hijinks went down for sure. Where are you, buddy? Where'd you go? Can you guys see it? Today, we're gonna focus on Saw Pit. For those of you guys that don't know, Saw Pit Trail's got some history. It's an older Santa Cruz trail that was shut down and reopened just recently and rerouted by the mountain bikers of Santa Cruz that took a lot of time, I think a couple years, building this trail. They're a volunteer group that takes care of all the trails in demo. I could tell after riding this trail how much care goes into it. That being said, today's channel sponsor is the Brookdale Lodge once again. They put me up for the entire week with Pupper Pip and I'm super thankful. Last week, we covered some of the accommodations that they remodeled beautiful rooms. You're in the redwoods above the city. One of the reasons I reached out to them was because of that. I wanted to be in the woods, get that vibe going on the trails, take it home with me at night. There's also some amazing history here. They're remodeling a huge portion of this lodge that's been around for over a hundred years. There's a dining room area with a natural creek that runs through it. Still to this day, I was given an awesome tour by Chris, one of the people that worked there, and showed me around the areas. And I've been to a lot of museums. I've felt this kind of like goosebump feel that I felt walking through here. Herbert Hoover used to fish off the balcony here with dining room guests such as Joan Crawford and Marilyn Monroe. This place was like a, a little bit of a getaway in the redwoods of Northern California for celebrities back in the day. There's an underground tunnel that goes underneath the street that they used to utilize in the prohibition days. Use Outsider 10 to get 10% off your stay here. I've talked enough. There's not much more to say. Guys, let's just get to it. We've got the saw pit trail to ride. We've got a lot of climbing to do which I'll take care of you guys don't worry about that just sit back relax without further ado I give you saw pit trail on part one of this two-part series let's get out there today we're heading back in and I've got a different route planned going a bit backwards to hit saw pit and braille this will give you a better idea of the ride out we're doing today and the ride back to get to Sulphur Springs Road which is the climb we're gonna do to get to the top and do two laps two and a half miles from here this road, as much as it's going to be a breeze getting to the up, it is brutal coming out of, but beautiful. It's interesting when I was climbing up from the flow trail the other day, I started seeing like berms like this. And I'm like, why are people riding down the road? This is the way out. And that's what gave me the idea. And I was like, oh, they're using it as an access road to get up as well. Duh. And that's what gave me the idea for today. We've taken a left on Sulphur Springs Road, and I think we've got about a two mile climb up to the top get me back into that climbing shape I'm not going to complain i need it starting to feel better other than giving me an excuse to stop and take a break on this climb i want to just take a moment right here because this is the spot i just realized that i took a picture of my yt jepsy the first week i got it i took a road trip up here right before i started the channel so thanks for all of you guys being out there thanks for your support thanks to those of you supporting on patreon i never thought the channel would catch on the way it did i really appreciate that you guys are sticking around and supporting and giving me feedback good or bad i can take it all i'm a humble guy i appreciate it all let's get one you guys this one's for you onward and upward i'll meet you guys at the top which will connect with ridge trail we're doing a bit of a loop de doop a loopy loop loopy poopy loop poop we're pooping on the loop. Here we go. That's gonna be a lot more brutal on the second round, I'm sure. Let's do this. We're on the last bit of ridge line right now, which is cool because is a little bit of a warm-up before we drop in to stop it not bad for a Thursday afternoon braille trail is gonna be on the right we're gonna hit that next round right now we're headed to stop it just to give you guys an idea how close they are flow trails right here so we went in yesterday and this is where saw pit goes. Boom. All right, let's regroup and uh, let's hit saw pit. Da -da -da -da. 
think the top part still ridge root for a little bit. I think Trail Forts or MDB Projects labels it as black. I'm not sure. Saw pits blue. We'll see how it goes. Right and blind, so eyes open. Keep it kind of chill. Got a little one hitter. Ah, it gets cooler as you get in the shade. That's beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> Caught that one last minute out of the corner of my eye. Thanks to the mountain bikers of Santa Cruz for all the work they did in this trail and all the work they do in the trails in here. Those are ones putting the work to make this trail happen and the surrounding ones. A couple fun ones. I think that was supposed to be a roller. I'll take it. Get a little steeper. A little skinny. Why not? Tight switchies right here. Really nice single track. Even with the brake bumps. Don't really care. That got steep real quick. <laughs> quick decisions right there. Oh, getting sneaky. I see what you're doing. Getting a little tech right there. What do we got here? Ooh, a droppy. This is a nice little section. We got a drop here, roll options, and then really chunky to the left, loose and tech on the right here. Trail came alive. This is so loose right now. I'll show you guys. Not that I'm not used to that. <laughs> so Cal goodness coming through in NorCal. I don't really trust the drop too much right now. I'm solo riding blind. You land in powder, that's a few inches deep. So I'm gonna need to break and cut really quickly. Just not feeling comfortable with that right now. Maybe after a rain or something when it's a little more grippy, but loosey goosey right now, trying to play it safe. Anyway, we still have some steep tech to deal with. So game face. Woo! According to Trail Forks, this section was ridge root still, label is black. And this is where saw pit starts. Knowledge is power, you guys. Now you have it. Let's do it. After a nice rain, I'd imagine this trail is so amazing as well. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. The single yes of the single track. Is that a thing? Oh, there was a thingy. I missed the thingy. Yeah. <laughs> 
don't know which way the trail's going. I'm like over braking because I just want to make sure I don't just fly off this place. Tell if that was a ride up. Sun was blazing on it. Yeah, first time. Woo! Let's keep it going. No time for stopping. Interesting off camber kind of ledge area. <laughs> Losing elevation, I heard my ears just pop. Pop, pop, pop. Beauty of a bridge. Such good work they're doing here. Wow, that's pretty. Damn. Extra effort there. Okay, thought about looking at it, but kind of was in too far. This is a rad trail, you guys. Whew. That looks like that'll do it. Saw pit, big check. Man, that trail is super fun. Really mixing it up with that one. It's like in between flow and braille. Not as technical as braille, not as flowy as flow nice little medium spot anyway onward and upward let's crank out that climb again let's hit braille not so fast yeah this ride has some hijinks left to it i promise you that next week we're going to go and head up to braille it's not going to be the most intense dh you're going to see on braille but probably one of the more entertaining ones. Hijinks ensued. You gotta stick around next week for part two. Thanks for sticking around. Like and subscribe. New videos every single week. If you wanna support the channel even more, head on over to Patreon where I've got early video releases, product giveaways, and group rides coming soon. I'll see you guys next week.